Welcome back, guys. So let's moon here. Let's uh, judge some people. Don't really remember what, uh, which one, but. Adamant's influence continues, Your Worship. I submit Lord Livius Erimond of Virantium, who remains loyal to Corypheus. We found him alive, offering extreme resistance, likely because the Order will ask for his head. Oh. In more colorful terms. To say nothing of justice you might personally require for what was suffered in the Fade. I'm struggling to understand how judging you can make up for anything that happened. I recognize none of this proceeding. You have no authority to judge me. Oh, I have on the not. contrary, many officials have communicated that they will defer to the Inquisitor on this matter. Because they fear, not just Corypheus, but Tevinter, rightful ruler of every piece of ground. I serve the living God. Bring down your blades and free me from the physical. Glory awaits me. Lord Erimond, any protection you thought you had has apparently been withdrawn. You will die by my hand. Petty actions. Okay. Uh... So straight up execution, is it? Okay. That was brutal. What should we judge another one? Another of the lingering pains of Adamant, your worship. Sir Ruth is a senior warden of the Order. She was one of the many who slit the throat of another to bind a demon. She does not contest this. In fact, she surrendered to us. She requests no mercy. She wants the public justice of the headman's axe. You were free to rejoin your comrades, and yet you... There is no excuse for my actions. I murdered another of the Order. Accepting their actions while thralls of Corypheus, many treaties allow wardens. I can't do it. I can't use the greater good to justify my crimes. As if it is wrong that this broke me. I've done worse with full sanction. I can do nothing except be an example of the cost. Nothing brings out fear and pity like a criminal bound for the mind. Have Sir Ruth put in the stocks. Then serve her sentence at hard labor. If it serves as a warning. Okay, so that was a bad call? I don't know. Anywho, let's uh, go to the war room. The last time I was at Alam Shiral was Countess Letienne's wedding. There were a dozen affairs, five, but until the Duchess was unmasked, I've never seen the Winter Palace in shock. It's disturbing, so few people in the. But let's not lose sight of victory. Your actions at the ball have secured us allies and favor. My favorite moment of the evening. <sighs> mm -hmm. right. what? what are you looking in the wall? <laughs> Alright, uh, one, two, no. And I cheated at the beginning, so seriously, no. It's time to plan our next attack. What's the state of the Inquisition? We're well loved in Orlay. Say the words, and Empress Celine will send her support. And your actions at Adamant denied Corypheus his army of pet demons. With Orle's support, our numbers match his. Corypheus' followers must be panicking. My agents agree. Our victories have shaken his disciples. 
Perhaps they'll rethink following the Darkspawn Magister from the dawn of time. Where is Corypheus now? After Adamant, Corypheus uprooted his major strongholds and sent them marching south to the Arbor Wilds. His army clearly wasn't prepared to flee. Our victories have them on the defensive. We strike Corypheus now, while his people are reeling. If he's hiding in the Arbor Wilds, that's where we finish him. But what is Corypheus doing in such a remote area? His people have been ra What he hopes to find, however... Which should surprise no one. Fortunately, I can assist. You have my attention, Le What Corypheus seeks in those forgotten woods is as ancient as it is dangerous. Okay. Which is? His best? Well, I do want to check the map first. Can I do that, please? Or are you just taking me away to some distant woods? This is an Illuvian. An elven artifact from a time long before their empire was lost to human greed. I restored this one at great cost, but another lies within the Arbor Wilds. That is what Corypheus seeks. You can restore an artifact like this. There was a price, but one I gladly paid. I found legends of an elven temple within the Arbor Wilds, untouched. It proved too dangerous to a... If Corypheus has turned south... What does it do? A more appropriate question would be, where does it lead? Okay. Teleporting. Brilliant. No, those trees are weird. If this place once had a name, it has long been lost. How do you know that? I mean, if you... I call it the crossroads. A place where all Illuvians join, wherever they might be. A useful trick for one who knows the ancient elves left no roads only ruins hidden in far-flung corners as you can see most of the mirrors are dark as for the rest a few can be opened from this side but only a few how did you not all the mirrors lead back to our world some of the Illuvians, all others, are closed. Open. With a key. I suppose. The key can be many things. I have knowledge as well as power. Often that is enough. This. And enter the Fade in the flesh. He learned of the Illuvian in the Arbor Wilds as a. You have made Corypheus desperate, Inquisitor. We must work. Okay, well, I'm I'm game. If you're game. I never loved the Templars, but seeing them mutilated with lyrium doesn't give me any cheer. Hmm. 
right, so we're up here. Oh yeah, that's right. We're going to... Don't have well, the strength we're going to get the last... Uh, uh, the last... Uh, what do you call it? The last door from the shard thing that we've been hunting. First, I'm gonna go actually talk to the war council without anyone interrupting. Then we are going to the hinterlands. <sighs> what happened in Adamant is a shame. I'm still reeling over the army of demons. Imagine what would have happened if the Inquisitor hadn't arrived. Inquisitor. Let's see what we have. Right, sixteen to nineteen. With an alluvion, Corypheus could cross into the Fade in the flesh. Indeed. The Inquisitor can attest that these artifacts still work if one knows how to use them. What happens when Corypheus enters the Fade? Why, he will gain his heart's desire and take the power of a god. Or, and this is more likely, the lunatic will unleash forces that tear the world apart. I won't allow it. I can't. Indeed, should Corypheus succeed? Pardon me, but does this mean everything's lost? Un Corypheus has a head start. No we should gather our. Can we wait for them? We should send our spies. Without support from the soldiers? Then what should we do? You follow the orders of your Inquisitor, Josephine. Have our allies send scouts to meet us in the wilds. Liliani, your fastest agents will... Together, we'll have enough spies to slow down... <laughs> <clears throat> Such confidence. But the Arbor Wilds are not so kind. We'd be remiss to not take advantage of your knowledge, Lady Morgan. Tis why I came here. Although it is good to see its value. Any further instructions, Inquisitor? The Inquisition began. I could ask for no. F I blah, speak blah, for blah. all of. We'll hound Corypheus in the wilds before he. All right, let's uh, go confirm operation. Sixteen to nineteen. Well, that shouldn't be too hard. I mean, we came from twelve to fifteen, and that was very easy. So,
doing? battle and uh, also I still only have fought one dragon inquisitor how goes the battle captain the red templars fall beneath our blades your worship commander cullen says they're nearly finished our scouts saw corypheus traveling towards an elven ruin to the north we can clear you a path through his armies Make the monsters pay, Captain. We shall not. Andraste guide you. I wonder, is it Andraste your soldiers invoke during battle, or does a more immediate name come to their lips? They show me respect, Morrigan. True. You are far more likely to come to their aid than a ch If your scouts report accurately... I Which is? A place of worship out of elven legend. If Corypheus seeks it, then the Whoa. Let us hope we reach this temple before. Faith in your commander is well placed, Ambassador. We are gladdened to see you, Herald. This day what are you will be doing called here? for ages. We are privileged to witness the sight of your work, men and with Orly at your side. Inquisitor, I hear this. That's where the fighting will be worst. Andraste, keep you safe. Keep yourself safe. <laughs> you sure you don't want to grab? <laughs> All right, let's uh, have a look at the map here and see what we're dealing with. Can't fast travel. of there are you many of you are there
the soldiers aren't careful with their fires, they'll do Corypheus's work for him. Come on, let's go plug some assholes. Do you sense the magic, Kraken? Something more powerful than the Red Templars. Uh, ring of critical chance, piece of crap. Why can I? I can't go back to the original map. Are we done here? Okay, so now what? Done, dude. Man, who are you fighting? Those were Grey Wardens. They must be the last of those enslaved at Adamant. We're 
remember the men they were, and we'll avenge them. Reach the second blockade? What the frick? Uh, yeah, we're not gonna go that way. I don't think. That is why. Right, cool. We got it. on the wall. I did that. Were we just attacked by elves? It seems this temple of Methal is not deserted after all. Perhaps these creatures are the reason few return from the Arbor Wilds.
Uh, what? Rare arms? So we're gonna reach the. God damn it! It seems to me like we're just. Uh running and running and running, and. Uh Nothing is quite happening. this the second brigade. Yep, we're trying. Easy. Right, the final blockade. Bet you piece of shit. Right. 
Come on! God damn it! It's super freaking annoying. Whatever it is, there, that must be the temple of Mithal. Be ready. 
Corypheus will be there. I hear fighting ahead. Milana Savanale. They still think to fight us, Master. These are but remnants. They <coughs> will not keep us from the Well of Sorrows. Well of Sorrows? You don't know. Be honored. Witness death at the hands of a new god. Last, Mathal's sanctum. Let us proceed before Corypheus interferes. Why is Lumpy after a sorrow well or whatever? Weren't we after some Ponzi mirror? I am uncertain of what he referred to. You were guessing. Corypheus might not be. Yes, I was wrong. Whatever the well of sorrows might be, Corypheus seeks. Let's find this well before Corypheus's people do. I want to know how Corypheus returned to life. We saw him die. And his life force passes on to any blighted creature, Darkspawn, or Grey Warden. Ah. Oh. And Corypheus cannot die. Destroy his body and he will assume another. We'll find a way to stop him once we're done here. It is strange. Archdemons possess the same ability, and still the Grey Wardens are able to slay them. Yet Corypheus, they locked away. Perhaps they knew he could do this, but not how. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, you know what? We're gonna... Ah, oh, shit. This is gonna be... And I can't... Damn it! All right. Well, <laughs> we can't go back out of here so uh this is gonna be a whole new episode thank you very much for watching this one hope you enjoyed it i did leave a comment or like or maybe even subscribe i'm oscar moon and this always i am out